The advice and opinions expressed by the host of Autism Live and her guests are meant solely as suggestion and should not be in any way construed as child-specific advice. Any choices you make in determining your child's treatment are completely at your own discretion. Uh, we, our guest is here, so we got to move on to our last story about Sesame Street. Um, we've had the actress who plays Julia uh, mm-hmm. on Sesame Street on the program. Nancy and I have interviewed her. I'm, I'm really proud of Sesame Street that they're taking this very seriously and not just resting on the laurels and saying, okay, we have a character on the spectrum um, that they've expanded. And like us here at the Autism Network, they've said, as we expand, we need to be employing people on the spectrum. Um, so I, I love that, uh, Nancy, I didn't get a chance to go, but they they had a thing from Exceptional Minds the other day where they were debuting some of the work that they've done with Sesame Street, these artists on the autism spectrum. Um, I didn't get to be there as they were debuting that, but I did get to see some of the videos. Did you by chance get to see any of the things that Exceptional Minds did with them? No, I did not. I wasn't aware of that, Shannon. It's super fun. Um, they they worked on this new video that is out right now um, uh, that is about Julia dealing with um, some sensory issues. And you you hear um, music and they're, um, it's done by people um, from Exceptional Minds. You hear sound effects. Uh, at one point she's talking about being afraid because there's a trash can that's banging in the wind and, and she's afraid of it. And, and there are these bang noises. And I loved that as I was reading uh, uh, what the Exceptional Minds had posted about that, that the artists who were making the music and, and banging the, the, uh, the top to the trash can, they're all people you and I know, Nancy. Uh, young and they got paid. That's so great. <laughs> Isn't that the the best thing on the? So I I'm thrilled. I hope you guys will check out these new videos that are out. This new one, um, it, uh, there's a, a whole set that's called Good Night, um, and there's routine cards that help you to get your child to go to bed. There's helpful hints in the video that I watched. Um, Julia was afraid. And mom uh, said, well, you know what? Let's draw about what, what we're afraid of. Let's mm-hmm. shed some light on it. Let's draw what we're afraid of. And so Julia gets out a crayon and she draws the, the trash can and they find a way to laugh at it, which I thought was a really productive way right. to deal with fears. Yeah. So um, you also mentioned, Shannon, that they have a, the added content aimed at the Chinese American autism community. So if you're a member of the Chinese American autism community, there's uh, now Mandarin and Cantonese versions of the digital storybook. We're amazing one, two, three. I love it. I absolutely love it. So check those out, you guys. Uh, We continue to be very proud of Sesame Street and the way they're handling this. Somebody said way back when Julia became a regular, they said, you know what's going to be great? when the kids who are the age that are watching this right now become the HR directors in 20, 30 years, and somebody with autism walks in the door to apply for a job, it's going to be a whole new ballgame, whole different thing, because they're going to have seen Julia. And I thought, oh, isn't isn't that something to look forward to? Uh, I hope that happens. Thanks for watching Autism Live. If you found anything helpful in this video, please give us a like. In fact, make sure that you smash that subscribe button on YouTube and give us a like on Facebook. You can also follow us on Twitter and Instagram for important updates. And please download our free podcast wherever you get your podcasts. See you next time. Until then, give your kiddos a hug from me and one for you too. Bye-bye for now. Subscribe, click here.
And if you'd like to check out some more of our videos, click here.